All right, Shalom. First off, I want to give all praises to Yah by Shem Yahshai. Double honors to the apostles of Great Millstone. And this is Shia Shalom to all the Akim out here that's doing and pushing the work in truth and sincerity. Um, I just want to go in on this topic of IUIC uh, taking off the whole winter. Um, here you have one of the uh, members of IUIC. Um, and and I'm going to just read it, what, what he said. Uh, Cause my I'm on my uh, doing it off my phone, but it says uh, his name is Ayas Athayak. It says I'm with IUIC, and I noticed the same thing. They didn't go out and preach all winter, and I asked them why. They said because it was too damn cold. Yet I saw Ephraimite Gabar from Thug Camp preaching in zero below weather. In Minnesota. So I asked him, well, uh, why are you still with them? And he said, no other camp uh, teach order like they do. Every other camp I used to listen to is all over the place. Not teaching our, our people how to keep the commandments, how to get our women in order. They are about rebuilding the nations. Now, notice how this guy never talked about prophecy or uh, what's coming to our people, you know? Um, the thing is that these guys just took off a whole winter, you know? And, like, the destruction is coming to this wicked-ass queendom known as America, which is Babylon, according to the scriptures, you know? And they're not going into prophecy. These guys are false prophets. You know, anytime you just take off a whole winter and like this destruction, because it seems like we're in the beginning of sorrows right now. But you got this destruction that's coming and it's all throughout the scriptures and they're not talking about any of this, you know. So they done took off this whole winter, you know, where it's like if it, it, it you're trying to rebuild a nation, but you took off the whole winter. That's being hypocritical. You know, people come out during the winter, you know. But um, not only that, you got this destruction that's coming and y'all people want to be sitting up there hibernating and, and doing whatever the heck y'all want to rather than going into what's coming, you know, trying to get out, reach the elect first and foremost, because that's the only people that's going to get it. You know, these two third people out here ain't worried about uh, waking up and, and coming into what the, the, the uh, to the law, statutes and commandments of the Lord, man. You know, like that ain't what it's about. That don't justify you at the end of the day. These guys don't even understand that, man. So at the end of the day, this destruction is coming to America and they don't want to go in on what's really uh, about to happen, you know. And, 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 and if it was up to them, a lot of people would have died. If the destruction would have came in the winter, they would have died. You know, because IUIC ain't out there warning people. And the Lord going to kill these niggas, man. Y'all about some y'all side is going to kill these niggas, man. He's going to destroy them, man. And 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 if some of the people are the elect are in there, they're going to come up out of that madness. But that's, that's silly to even stay in this group that done took off the whole winter. You know, just because you think that they teaching the commandments. When the commandments say, go out there. You know, go out there on the highways and hatches, man. But um, I want to show you how these guys are uh, false prophets. Um, it says uh, Matthew 24 and 3. It says, and he and, and as he sat upon the Mount of Olives, the disciples came unto him privately, saying, tell us when shall these things be and what shall be the sign of thy coming? And of the end of thou, I mean, of and of the end of the world. And Yahweh Shah answered and said unto them, Take heed that no man deceive you, for many shall come in my name, saying, I am Christ, and shall deceive many. And you shall hear of wars and rumors of wars. Now we got rumors of wars and all that going on right now. Russia, Ukraine, every single day it seems like it's something happening, every day. And they're not up here trying to be occupied in these prophecies. They done took the whole winter off, man. 
not even uploading the whole video. It say, see, see that ye be, be not troubled for all these things must come to pass. But the end is not yet for nation shall rise against nation and kingdom against kingdom. And there shall be famines and pestilences and earthquakes in diverse places. All these are the beginning of sorrows. These things are, are happening, you know. We in this time of, of, of prophecy, you know. This RFID chip is about to really be out here, you know. And these guys is lollygagging around. Lord knows what they doing during this whole winter. But if it was up to them, a lot of people would be dead because they don't occupy occupying this prophecy, man. It say, then shall they deliver you up to be afflicted and shall kill you. And you shall be hated of all nations for my name's sake. Okay, so the thing is, right, like these guys, y'all take this truth for, for a joke, man. You know what I'm saying? Y'all take this truth for a joke, man. Like it, the scripture says that everybody, you're going to be hated once you come into this, man. You're not going to be liked or, or loved by everybody, man. We're not trying to rebuild no whole entire nation right now. This ain't the time for that, man. People out here really going to be sitting up here dying, man, be, be, before this word, man. And y'all took off the whole winter, man. So what type of men of the Lord are y'all, man? Y'all need to get y'all selves right, man, because the Lord going to kill y'all. He, he about to start uh, getting rid of all these fake Israelite camps out here, man. And with that, one, give all praise to y'all by some y'all side. The ones, the apostles, great millstone. And share Salawan to all the Akim out here that's doing and pushing the work and truth to